While I appreciate the previous speaker's remark, I'd like to point out that if we were to pass the ERA amendment, everything that she just spoke about and advocated for would be gone. There would be no distinction between sexes at all. There would be no breastfeeding rooms. There would be no bills, as Representative Moeller even passed, stating that we should have a women's task force that dealt with women's issues. All of that would be negated if we were to pass an ERA amendment. It would literally say there is no distinction or difference between the sexes, which is absolutely ridiculous and unscientific. So um, enough of this. Uh, let's, let's just get back to the duties and the work that we're supposed to do here. I'll tell you what, personally, I have never felt that my progress in the State House has been impeded by my sex, No, I've ever felt held back by my sex. Women have more opportunities than ever before in our lifetime. Women per complete more college degrees than men do. So um, let's just realize that scientifically speaking, there is a different be difference between the sexes. And you have come up with a number of bills. You have proposed a number of bills to recognize that distinction. And I'd just like to point that out. Thank you very much.